Good morning, everyone. I am Ma'am Dory Bartolome. And I am Sir Ad Magbohos. Your Masters of Ceremony for our 48th Nutrition Month Celebration 2022. Every July of each academic year, our school celebrates the Nutrition Month. This school year's theme is New Normal na Nutrition, Sama-sama nating gawa ng solusyon. After a series of activities, we're finally concluding with a blast! Right, ma'am. There were lots of fun and enjoyment in every activity that has been done. We have seen each participant showcase their talent and become aware as well as with the importance of nutrition in combating this pandemic. To start our closing ceremony, let us sing together as we watch and listen to the Philippine National Anthem followed by the invocation to be led by Miss Maria Luisa Mansayon and afterwards, the Pasay City team. Mga kababayan, ang pambansang awit ng Pilipinas. Aming Diyos na makapangyarihan sa lahat, kami po ay nagpupuri at nagpapasalamat sa inyong kadakilaan. Salamat po sa kapatawaran ng aming mga kasalanan. Diyos Ama, gabayan po ninyo kami sa virtual na palatuntunan ito sa selebrasyon ng Nutrition Month ngayong buwan ng Hulyo taong 2022. Pagpalain po ninyo kami sa programang ito, lalo na ang mga guro at mag-aaral. Bigyan po ninyo kami ng katalinuhan at kalakasan na aming kailangan at gayon din po ang mga manunood upang maunawaan at matutunan ang tunay na mensahe ng programang ito. Dinadalangin din po namin ang matagumpay na pagtatapos ng virtual na palatuntunan ito. Ito lamang po ang aming hinihiling sa pangalan ng anak na si Heso Kristo. Amen.
give us the opening remarks, let us all listen to our principal, Mr. Peter R. Callan Jr. Magandang buhay sa inyong lahat and welcome to the closing and awarding ceremony of the Nutrition Month 2022 with its theme, New Normal na Nutrition, Sama-samang Gawa ng Solusyon to our OIC, Enabled OIC TLE HE Practical Arts Department Head, Ma'am Mildred Rumamban, to the teachers of the TLE HE Practical Arts Department, to the other department heads in the different subject areas, to all the teachers, welcome to this activity, to our closing program. Today, we will learn or we will know who are the winners into the different contests held a few days ago. So to the winners, may advance congratulations. And to those who did not make it, there's another year next year, syempre. But of course, we'd like to thank the department who was uh, involved on this, the TLE and HE, because in spite of the pandemic, they were able to celebrate, or we were able to celebrate Nutrition Month. For that, it's a big uh, salute on your part. So, I'm excited to watch and to find out who are the winners in today's, uh, in the different competitions we had. Magandang buhay po sa inyong lahat. Thank you very much, Sir Peter Cannon. And to witness the highlights of the PCWH's 48th Nutrition Man Celebration, please sit back, relax, and watch the videos.
Congratulations to all the winners! Mabuhay!
Wow, that's very awesome. This year's celebration is truly something to remember. Correct, sir! And so in order for us to recognize and appreciate all those who gave their best in this celebration, let us all watch as Mrs. Maria Victoria Ronan award the certificates to participants and winners. Good day everyone! Today, we will celebrate and recognize our brilliant students and teachers who showcased their talents in this year's Nutrition Month celebration. Allow me to present the Certificate of Appreciation to the following judges. Let me read the citation. Pasay City West High School presents this Certificate of Appreciation to during the 48th Nutrition Month celebration with the team New Normal na Nutrition sa Masamang Gawa ng Solusyon. Held last June 13 to 24, 2022 at Pasay City West High School, given this 4th day of July 2022 at Pasay City West High School, TLE Department, Pasay City. Signed, Mrs. Mildred C. Romanban, OIC TLE Department and Mr. Peter R. Cannon Jr., Principal 4. Mr. Raymart A. Pocolangas, Mrs. Mary Lex A. Diseo, and Ms. Laarni Queen C. Britannico for the Digital Poster Making Contest. Ms. Juliet H. Brioso, Ms. Chris Marilyn R. Cabatanya, Ms. Marilu T. Berdahe, and Mr. Kenyal Q. Ordonez for the Nutri Jingle Contest. And for the On The Spot Poster Making Contest, we have Mr. Robert Sandahan, Mr. Omar Aguilar, Mr. Nomer Lopez, and we also have Mrs. Ana Alisa Luciano, Michelle Claire Cabicol, and Mr. Jason M. Bustos for the Nutri Cooking Blog parent and child collaboration. And lastly, we have Mrs. Filipina A. De Guzman, Mr. Peter R. Cannon Jr., and Ms. Ann Camille C. Romanban for the PCWHS Teacher Master Chef Edition. And now, the most awaited moment is the awarding of certificates to the following winners. For the online Notary Quiz Contest, the winners are Jana Mikaela B. Arzaga from Grade 10 Mabini, 5th place. Hyacinth Rogeline T. Alvarez from Grade 7 Orchid, 4th place. Francine Veron T. Mangalaw from Grade 8 Mayumi, 3rd place. From Grade 9 Banaba, we have Gary T. Timogan. Second place. First place goes to Sniper Sage A. Tabuzo from Grade 7 Rose. And the winners for the On The Spot Poster Making Contest are Le Mark V. Tohot from Grade 8 Makakalikasan, third place. Karil Just C. San Juan from Grade 11 Orion, second place. And the first place goes to Danielle Escamadu from Grade 10 Kudarat. For the digital poster making contest, the winners will also receive a certificate of recognition. Third place, Samantha Nicole N. Noliora, Grade 12 Howlite. Second place, Mark Cyrus B. Burmas, Grade 11 Rigel. First place, Kyle Adrian G. Bernisi from Grade 12 Howlite. For the Nutri Jingle Contest, the winners will also receive a certificate of recognition. And the winners are, second place is from Grade 10 Aquino. We have 
Micaela Jane Sabarillo, Gabriela Vega Florendo, Eliza Jean S. Andrade, Anika Panikan Daigo, and John Rafael S. Shirato. First place goes to Grade 9 Aguho. We have Sayron Daniel Mendoza, Justin James A. Calma, Angela Faith J. Valdez, Luwilin B. Timaho, and Donna Carlene S. Aspa. For the Nutri Cooking Vlog Parent-Child Collaboration, the winners are Jacob Marvin D. Delia of Grade 7 Hyacinth, 3rd place. 2nd place goes to Serenity M. National from Grade 10 Kudarat. And the winner is Cherry May Mangalugnan from Grade 9 Caballero. And for the PCWHS MasterChef Teachers Edition, the winners are 4th place goes to the Tandem from Filipino and English Department. We have Mrs. Loretta J. Gonzaga and Ms. Jeneline E. Barring. Third place is from our Senior High School Department and Edukasyon sa Pagpapakatao Tandem. We have Ms. Lovelyn S. Pagatpat and Ms. Gina G. Mendoza. Second place goes to the Tandem from Science Department and Araling Panlipunan Department. We have Mr. Jason M. Bustos and Mrs. Susana C. Kunanan. And the winner for the first ever Master Chef Teachers Edition, we have the tandem from MAPE and Mathematics Department, Mrs. Adelina P. Limos and Mr. Jose P. Barsha Jr. Congratulations, winners! For those non-winners, they will be given a certificate of participation. This day would not be possible without the unending support of our beloved parents, our school principal, TLE department head, and my colleagues. Please give a round of applause to all who have given their time and effort in this year's Nutrition Month celebration. Thank you and God bless us all. Thank you, Ma'am Maribic Ronan. To give us the closing remarks, let us all watch and listen to Mrs. Mildred C. Romanban, our TLE Department OIC. To our dynamic school principal, Mr. Peter R. Cannon Jr., our education program supervisor, Dr. Ramil Dorol, fellow teachers, parents, and students, Good day to all of you. During this time of pandemic, keeping ourselves healthy has indeed been a great challenge. There are too many things to be worried about. How to stay COVID-free. How to face the spiking prices of fuel and commodities. How to keep the kids interested in school activities among others. With these anxieties, we most of the time tend to set aside our health. We choose to focus on other things that we think are more important without realizing that our health is far more important than the things that we are worrying about. If we have a healthy body, surely we have stronger immune system that can fight off the COVID-19 virus. If we have a sound body, we seldom get sick and we lessen the chance of spending extra time and money in medical care. If we are healthy and not sickly, we will be able to perform better in whatever task we do. We can think better and we, we can do better. But the big question is, how can we be healthy if the threat of the virus is just around the corner? And worse, there are some restrictions that have lessened our physical activities which eventually can lead to our weight gain. My dear friends, there are so many ways for us to stay healthy under the new normal. First, we must always follow the health protocols. Observe social distancing, wear face masks, keep our hands clean. Second, Let's eat healthy food. 
we can always prepare simple, affordable, and healthy food. Malunggay leaves are very abundant. We can mix that in noodles or a can of sardines. Munggo is very nutritious and affordable. We can boil it, mash it, and use it as a meat extender. Squash can also be mashed and used as meat extender. We just have to be creative in preparing our meals. Third, keep ourselves active. We can do simple exercises at home to burn out some calories. Chugging, brisk walking, jumping jack, skipping rope. These are some of the simple exercises that we can do. Fourth, let us keep a positive outlook in life. Do not focus on the negative things. There are many more reasons to smile and be thankful than to frown and be regretful. And lastly, let's spend quality time with our family. And this does not mean simply staying in the house. Play with the kids, watch movie together, help in the household chores and many others. Staying healthy is not difficult. On the contrary, it is easier than what we thought. This new normal should not be a reason for us to be less healthy. Rather, it should encourage us more to lead a healthier life, not only for ourselves but more importantly for our children. Let us all act together and put all our efforts para ang new normal na nutrisyon ay magawa natin ang solusyon. I would like to take this opportunity to thank our school principal, Mr. Peter R. Cannon Jr., and all the department heads for their support of the Teacher's Master Chef Edition and the teacher contestants who showed their cooking skills. The chairman of the different activities, students and parents for their full cooperation. And most especially, all the TLE teachers. This celebration will not succeed without your initiative and collaboration. Once again, thank you very much and good day. Mabuhay po tayong lahat. Thank you, Ma'am Mildred. And that's all for this celebration. May everyone continue to experience the joy we have felt this month. In the meantime, we want to say goodbye for now. I am Ma'am Dory Bertolome. And I am Sir Ad Magbohos. Remember, you don't have to eat less, just eat right. Thank you very much and mabuhay!